you know to think of 2008 in the rest of the world facebook is coming up yeah america is growing yeah. obama is getting elected <laughs> there's excesses this mcdonalds all over the world and then there's a part of the world just like this that is what i'm telling you na ranveer there is a lot of difference between real life and real life real life and real life are very different things there was a adventure camp uh, can i speak something please sir yeah there was a adventure camp where 11 12th and big boys and they were coming in army it was being conducted in manali and people expected ki since 11 12th lot and a quite notorious so you go i was second in command that time i had gone there uh, there was some uh, senior officer's daughter some general visiting she said ki we want to have maggi and you know gol gappa and all that i said my food is already ready sir and it'll go waste ye ko bhi khila do and there were a lot of people didn't khilao khilao unko and i do for this anyway it was done although, although not easy to and manage for those many maggies and those fancy items it was prepared and next day i got everyone the single podium auditorium and i started playing some pictures i want to show you something and then i'd shown them pictures where uh, people were drinking kettle urine uh, 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 kettle urine yeah and with small small pipes they were trying to collect one one drop of the blood apna water this is from sudan from sudan and there was a point in stage and with some music and some message i written it i was showing to those children they started singing and they few of the girls they started crying they said sir please stop it my why should i stop it you do you're not ashamed of doing something very funny i'm showing you the reality go through it and look up i showed it to them lot of children they had uh, water in their eyes few of them they cried also they said me do you know what is this then i told them ki this is sudan they are real photographs not real photographs and uh, there after i had uh, shown them other photographs but this was the food which was prepared yesterday night which has gone wasted you know because we are sitting at location there is no one to consume food worth so much gone wasted but then i called that guy who had prepared the food me up please you tell them what time you wake up in the morning he said sir for 100000 children i barely sleep for about 2 hours i get up at early 3 in the morning so that i can prepare their breakfast may you know any one of you knows his name you don't even know bloody his name theek hai you are least interested as far as you are getting warm food fancy food you are okay with that my where was the requirement and yesterday you nobody would have died if you and you were not having maggi but you want it and you had at the cost of wastage of so much of food and there are people who are actually drinking kettle urine because there is no water may you want to try may of course you can't because you know there are better options available with you but the lesson was driven home the idea was well received by the kids in the environment lot of Uh, they got emotional and a few boys and girls they came said we came uh, sir can i hug you of course more the merrier ma'am please can i hug you ha <laughs> ha uh, please are as such with this amazon we treated getting in ma'am yeah so, in the middle of one hour takes we lit a candle as it turned into military date of sorts <laughs> military date yeah <laughs> but go on <laughs> so so usme na yaar it idea was well received by the kids and there after it was every they started saying thanks to that guy got to know more about the guy who used to prepare food with them they were thankful and they never wasted food today also when i'm training my kids i ensure i have meal with them not even single piece of food is left in the plate i ensure this and they don't leave ever 